Hello, fellow Who Reads, what's my Who Views? And even Doctor Who into the Dalek. And uh, in this, the Doctor saves his, uh, his soldier named uh, Journey Blue. And um, it's kind of like the thing where he, he's just uh, talking and he's trying to threaten him with a gun to bring him back to her base and him just keep interrupting her, trying to get her to ask politely or just the proper way. And I turn her base to the hospital. And the person in charge named Uncle uh, was about to kill him, uh, kill the doctor since uh, the location of the base is supposed to be secret or something. And they think they don't take prisoners, but they have a defective Dalek in the hospital. And the war against the Dalek, so I don't know why they actually have a Dalek in the hospital that warned them. Is it just like, for story purposes or what? Oh. And anyway, this episode also introduces uh, a Danny Pink, who is uh, a math teacher and an ex soldier, and he starts to turn up a bit. Or one of the kids uh, asks him if he ever killed uh, a civilian or a non soldier or whatever. Uh, when he first meets Clara, she kind of made a joke. About uh, can somebody then have to go cry about it? And Danny thinks that someone told her about him that crying in during in class. But they haven't heard anything, and the the stuff there everything was but but bit awkward or got a bit awkward. Hmm. And uh, it took time, but they eventually agreed to go out for a drink later. And then uh, when uh, Clara went to her cupboard, the uh, doctor with the uh, coffee, even though it was three weeks since uh, the end of um, the breath. And while they're in the tire, the doctor has a question for Clara that was a part of what's going on the entire this entire season. Was asking her if he if he thinks he, he's a good man. And uh, she says no. And this also has a beginning of the doctor's uh, for some reason hating soldiers. Mm, I don't know. And turns uh, out the doctor, uh, Clara, and the uh, journey and some other soldiers got to be shrunken down. Into uh, the Dalek and see if they can fix what's wrong with them or it. Yeah, they make a. I think they make a reference to the the movie. Uh, Fantastic Voyage with Doctor Zeta make a good movie, but not good for something else. Mm. And this is the first time uh, the Doctor or Doctor Who has done the uh, strong strong. Carter down to get into somebody else and to fix some sort of thing. I think they did this in the K Lions first episode. Hmm. Anyway, everybody gets uh, struck down into the Dalek and Doctor saying that uh, this is the worst place in the universe to be. And thanks to one of the soldiers, uh, some Dalek antibodies. Starts on up. Yeah. Oh yeah, and somebody they think that since uh, this Dardic that the Doctor later, later on uh, names Rusty is a good Dardic because uh, he wants to kill other ones. And Doctor Tinker is also thinking it's a good Dardic. Even though he's seen some good Dardics like uh, Zek and uh, Khan, I think book called A Good Dalek or the first book or something like that. So don't know. And uh, Rusty has to give uh, is there reasons why he think he wants to, to sort of Dalek since they 
Yes, he saw a star being born and since that dark destroyed millions and millions of, of stars and they keep being reborn as futile to just, just uh, to kill something that uh, life will always run away be reborn or whatever uh, turned out that Rusty has a radiation poisoning I can say some part of the body or, or, or the machine that the less irrigation. Yeah, I thought the dark ran on background radiation in the time war. So I never heard it, 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 it goes to when it when it when it has the uh, they uh, get the radiation or something. Ugh, I don't know. Um, when they do fix uh, Rusty, he go back to being a, a normal Dalek, and yeah, the doctor just seems to just, uh, just glad that he's right, and Clara, he slaps him. Cause I don't, I don't think he, he's enjoying being right, just, he just said he was. Uh, he had an idea of how to get Rusty uh, back to thinking that the uh, the, that like does uh, get his memory back of seeing the uh, reborn star. Um, no one saw that dies after their life. So uh, the antibodies get yeah, her set up the uh, clever and journey while they uh try to fix uh trying to get the repressed memory that that uh, Rusty had of the star. And that's why Rusty's also from the Missy. And General Rossi called the uh, a dark fleet to the last one to exterminate her people. Hmm. And somehow Clara is able to uh, activate this suppressed memory. I don't even think the doctor told her how to do it. And uh Yeah, Doctor actually hooks his um, brain into Rusty's. And it seems like he's getting true to Rusty's own in the beauty of the universe. But when Rusty looks into the doctor's uh, soul, he just sees a uh, uh, hatred for the dies and seeing the uh, dies being destroyed and that. So he's back to one to exterminate the Daleks. And the doctor just shocked trying to talk him down. Uh, it doesn't work and. Rusty decides to leave with the other uh, Dark saying he sent out a retreat signal. And I don't think they needed to put in the line where Rusty's saying that the Doctor uh, is a good Dalek. It was still way better in Dalek and probably in Jubilee. So I don't know why Muffet put that in there. And in the end, Doctor just leaves, getting a bit of a goodbye, and Journey wants to travel on, but the Doctor doesn't the one heard since he's a soldier. Again, it's only a phase I grow out of, but uh, it's not right now. And, uh, Clara's getting ready for her uh, drink with Danny and saying that she do not know if Doctor's called man, but he knows that he is trying out what matters. And, uh... Yeah, I think the acting in this episode is good, but... The writing is just bad, especially for that. I've already said it before, but I'll just say it again, because I didn't. I think, uh, seeing Moffat was too focused on the hardware of the dialogue rather than focusing on the uh, card and mutant. But, uh, I guess it this isn't the worst of his uh, Dalek stories. I'm thinking that maybe Asylum of the Daleks or uh, The Magician's Apprentice and which is familiar are probably worse. And Mercy does hope again in a 
at twice upon a time, so I guess he's one of the bring him back since he, he was a second uh, uh kind of in the Doctor the Top Doctor Flop or whatever. I just wonder why the director didn't send Rusty to the Dark Asylum since they would have would they would have thought he was malfunctioning and they were going cra crazy for uh, destroying his own kind, but I don't know. And once again, the Dark Asylum come uh, a couple, a, as he had no more, is like a concept of beauty. Yeah, and they never had content for elegance, so I don't know how to kind of have one for beauty. I don't know. I think Muffet sort of looked at the script more, or just uh, took out a few things. And what is with the two characters in this uh, having the colors last names? Ugh, I don't know. I mean, they actually going to still be a bit better with doc the Doctor and Claire, I mean, Robin Hood. But apparently it's at the, at the, at the time some stuff like that was going to have to change some of it. But I'll get more to that uh, next time. And to time, I'll see you guys later.